Hello, this is Onyx Tarot by Aubrey, and today I'm going to be doing a message for cancer. So thank you all so much for hitting the like button and subscribing. I really do appreciate it. Let's go ahead and get the good things coming to cancers. Good things coming to cancers. Okay, so cancer, we have fair woman dealings or a relationship with a woman with blonde gray or white hair we also have skull hidden secrets can harm you and then you have cat a two-faced friend and bottom of the deck is bowl plenty of material wealth all right okay so let's see what we have here for cancers all right um so the good things coming towards you there's some type of um, either feminine energy here. Let's see who this person is. Ten of Wands. Okay. So there's some type of woman or person or feminine energy that you may work with. Um, you may know this person very like vaguely or just see them sometimes. I'm not sure. But whatever it is, this person has a lot of burden on their back right now uh, with the Ten of Wands. You can see this person is carrying a lot on their back. They feel overworked. They feel stressed. Um, there's some type of secrets that this person has. Um, okay, let's see what the Ten of Wands is. Why are they stressed? Ten of Wands. Ten of Wands. Okay, we'll take those. All right, we have the Eight of Pentacles reverse, Knight of Pentacles reverse, and the Wheel of Fortune reverse. Okay, so this is somebody who, again, you, I feel like you either work with them or you are in some type of collaboration with them. This could be somebody that's at your job, a friend, a family member. Uh, this person has some, I'm hearing tricks up their sleeve. The song Cowboy Like Me by Taylor Swift is like playing in my head right now, uh, which really talks about um somebody who's like used to scamming people or getting you lying to people to get what they want or lying to get what they want and then they met their match okay so eight of pentacles reverse um is somebody in the knight of pentacles reverse wheel of fortune reverse i don't know if this person withheld the truth from you or withheld some type of money payment um lied about something um omitted some type of truth but um i feel like they are going something is happening in their life based on whatever they did to you okay um what is a wheel of fortune reverse i'm curious four of swords reverse so yeah this person could have hid a lot of information from you uh the four of swords is like gaining information um you're not really taking action on information. Something just laid to rest. And then the four of swords in reverse is like, whoop, here we go. Some type of information uh, resurfaces. Now, this could have to do with your money um, or with some type of payment. But for a lot of you, it'll just be somebody in your life um, that you experience some type of ending with. And I feel like somebody didn't handle something properly. Yeah, because they just didn't want to. Um, or they thought they would get away with something. The Eight of Pentacles in reverse for Cancer. Eight of Pentacles in reverse is a Two of Pentacles reverse. So yeah, this could definitely have to do with money or some type of lie or manipulation. What did they lie about? What flipped? The Two of Cups. So this person could have lied about some type of partnership a relationship who they were friends with who they were with they could have said they were with somebody and they're not um they could have said they were with some they were not with somebody and they are um this could be a sagittarius but it could literally be any sign sagittarius leo uh scorpio any sign though um hmm i feel like for those of you those of you who resonate with this this person could have made um made it seem like they were like holier than thou or that they were an angel and that they were actually working with you when they were really doing the complete opposite okay so what is hidden secrets can harm you this person has some type of secret about the chariot in reverse so i feel like 
this is somebody who's getting delayed. Um, they may have wanted to go forward with something and they can't for some reason. Ten of Cups reverse. This could have been, um, hmm. Knight of Swords. So somebody could have tried to, again, like manipulate a situation so that it went in their favor. This could have had to do with you moving, moving forward in a company. Um, this could have to do with your family. Somebody just didn't want you to be single, unencumbered, or just basically more stable than they are or appear more stable than they are. But this person is getting delayed for some reason. Page of Swords reverse and the Magician reverse. Yeah, so some type of lie. That this person, something this person lied about is being uh, thoroughly looked into, investigated even. Page of Swords reverse, Magician reverse. That's, that's Emperor reverse, Four of Pentacles reverse, Six of Swords. So yeah, I don't know if this is like a crooked boss or just a liar. Um, this could be somebody who, uh, this is somebody who manipulated something for money or control, Okay. Um, whatever this person did, they wanted to, they could have utilized somebody else to do this. This could be like a third party situation, work or romantic. But uh, this person was hiding the fact that they they delayed you or, or tried to financially impede you um, so that you wouldn't be successful. But you are, okay? Um, this is interesting. So you have two-faced friends here. So I feel like somebody is really jealous of your stability. They're jealous that somebody chose you. They're jealous that you're seen as honest. And I feel like you're going to realize um, as this comes, as some type of truth comes out about this person um, and whatever they lied about, um, especially tied to a financial situation, a family situation, a contract, a work environment, um, or relationship. You're going to see this person... Five of Swords, clarifying the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. You're going to see this person basically, um, you're going to see their true colors very soon. What What is this person's next steps towards cancer? What is this fair woman's next steps towards cancer? <clears throat> the Hermit, Nine of Cups, Queen of Wands reverse, and the Sun. Okay, so basically you may not hear anything from this person for a while. I feel like this person's going to go ghost. So like if this is email, text messages, friendship, I feel like this person's going to go ghost from you for a little while. And then they're going to basically kind of like handle handle you or handle a situation the best that they can. Um, nine of wands because they know that you're not backing down or you're not allowing them to manipulate a situation what you don't see is the sun so this person's going to be clear and honest especially if this is somebody who is in charge of your money or if it's somebody that again you were in a relationship with or in a friendship with um i feel like this person's going to be honest about how, whatever they were cheating you out of or breadcrumbing you with maybe they got a friend to you know co-sign them breadcrumbing you you'll have to let me know what this is uh but i definitely see that some type of two-faced friend is going to be revealed to you um and they're going to maybe maybe ghost you for a lot of you for like six days or you know throughout the rest of the year or something and then they're going to kind of come back and be honest about um whatever the issue was whether they felt like you weren't giving enough to them which ended a friendship ended a relationship um maybe they felt like you were taking advantage of them and so in turn they did the same to you um okay so let's clarify bowl <laughs> what is plenty of material things for cancer Seven of Cups. So you're going to see um, a lot of really good manifestations come in for you. Uh, Seven of Cups is having like numerous options, especially financially. So I feel like you are going to be um, leveling up, buying new clothes, new shoes, material things. Um, if this is work and this is like a money situation, somebody just did not want you to exceed them or have a better car than them. It sounds so stupid, but again, um, 
this is somebody who's very kind of jealous of you. So they kind of sabotage you or working with you or being friends with you or whatever the case is. They sabotaged it in order to make themselves better, but then it just didn't work out. So again, you're going, something gets revealed to where you realize that this person, this person's true vendetta. And I feel like you're going to basically, I feel like you're going to feel bad for them at some point and i also feel like you're not even going to take action towards them you're just going to kind of like again close the cycle clarifying the um or clarifying i split the deck and i have the queen of cups and the world i feel like you're going to be closing a cycle with a friend but again in turn you're going to see that this person going out of your life or this friendship going out of your life um it, it's for the best because you're going to actually bring in more friends and meet more friends in the next three weeks i'm predicting um, especially through work events or events where you go, where people are going, like, maybe you have a friend that's like, hey, come to this event. And there's people that they work with and they network with. You're not going to have issues with people that you meet in the future. And I also feel like you're going to trust your discernment a lot more, too, because a lot of you, um, I'm getting that a lot of you kind of felt like a weird vibe with this person um, or you could have just again, try to figure out why this person was being fake or shady or whatever the case is. And I feel like a lot of you are going to get that, um, that vindication and also just the clarity that you need in order to understand something and then move on. Okay. So definitely feel free to let me know your thoughts. Thank you guys for hitting the like button, subscribing, and thank you all so much for watching.